No, you carry on talking. I just I'm live. No, that's fine. I'll. Uh, I think I might maybe need to turn the sound down a bit. It's uh, it's loud. Uh, I can turn mine up a bit if you want, but it's clipping bad as it is. No, no, it was my, it was me. Just just truck noise, which I like. I like having my truck so it's noisy. Yeah, but the the movement's been nice to have, mind. I've I've adjusted my curve a lot, mind. I don't know right. if you have. Yes. Uh, no, I haven't, I haven't been that. I just wanted to see it working in the other things, you know. Yeah, but the curve, adjusting the curve's really nice to do. Oh, there's so much scope once you get, I mean, we only had them in such a short amount of time, you know. Yeah. Hi, everyone. Just to let everyone know, we are currently in Glasgow, having a laid back yeah. night tonight because I'm away again tomorrow and Wednesday. And my next convoy with you lot will be Friday. And my last convoy with everyone was last Tuesday. So I just, we changed tonight because you guys couldn't have joined in anyway because it was Project Cars. So we're having a bit of a laid back night. We're in uh, our own colours. You can do whatever colour you want tonight. Even if you're with Armstrong Haulage, you can have any colour you like. It does not matter. Uh, tonight you won't get wrong for it. So yeah, uh, I'm good to go, mate. I've got a trailer. Yeah, I've got a trailer as well, so we'll so go straight we'll, in there. We'll go into the cargo market. I can only say that everyone's looking uh, fantastic anyway. All the trucks... Uh you know, whatever colour they are, they look brilliant. Yeah, well, I was, that's what I was thinking. Maybe to do it once a month or so, just have a bit of a. Well, that's kind of. Right. I, so I where, where have you got to? Right. Well, I could go to Christian Sand with the, uh, some large tubes. Christian Sand. Where's that? That's over in Norway. How far? Uh, five hundred oh. and something. Uh, Christian Sand. Right. Well, I've got large tubes to Oslo. And I go through Christian Sand, literally. Yeah, to get there. Yeah, like literally, right. we've got the ferry to Christian Sand, so that works for me. That mine's it's seven hundred mile. Excellent, right? I'm taking the Christian Sand, and Mark's taking the Oslo. If anyone looking for a job, if you really want to get one, either Christian Sand or Oslo. Don't forget, but no, no problem if people just want to follow along with a, a, a trailer. Absolutely. It's uh, just about enjoyment. Good Is to it? be back on with everybody. I am absolutely desperate for fuel though. The only other thing I was going to say to you is the head tracking doesn't work that well on multiplayer. Oh, does it not? Frame rates. Ah, right. It's really stuttery. Really? Yeah, well obviously it's stuttery anyway. Like now I've only got 11 frames, so... Ah, right. Add, add, add the head movement in with the 11 frames, obviously it becomes... Do you know what I mean? Yeah, definitely. I mean, I, I don't know if anyone else out there has actually looked into them. Uh, like I've been gobsmacked. I've got a couple of little things I've just talked to Mark about, but I race and I just... It was just blown away with it once, you know, it just worked so well. Ah, I'm loving it, like, I mean, for the trucking, perfect. For, my drifting probably, if I really detuned it, just to give a bit of movement. But I think, for me, obviously with the, having the GoPro as well, it can become a little much. <laughs> yeah. But yeah, I, I was thinking that. Yeah. So, but it is fun, you know. For I'm absolutely thoroughly enjoying it, and it's certainly worth the money. Absolutely. Yeah. I don't know if it would be worth double personally. When you can get that one for, for that price, I don't think the track IR would be worth the extra cash. I don't know what that would give you extra. Well, it, it's just, it, it does give you the same thing. It's not. A, it's just because it was out first and it was mass produced. You know, exactly. they, they, they use like a bit more professional parts in a way. Yeah. Uh, well, I mean, obviously to keep the cost down, they've used uh, what they can, and they've got to make a profit. Oh yeah and i don't think they're making a massive profit as you know now you look into merchandise and that there's not a massive uh you know it's very hard to turn a profit yeah hey james that we i'm using the track hat is what we're using not the actual hat i'm yeah. using the track clip but it's made by track hat. i don't know why they don't change the name to be honest because it can yeah. be quite misleading <laughs> i think because they did the company from what i can look they started by doing the hat yeah they did and put, and putting the LEDs in and I think it's sort of, this is only that new thing that they've done you know yeah they've only had this out a year or so yeah uh, but I say I just think you can certainly rebrand at any time 
Yeah. How have you found battery life on it? I've never had to charge it. I, I charged it last night just be, just in case it was flat. Yeah. But no, I don't. I don't. Don't think there would be a problem. I've got it on now, like. Yeah. I, I've got a button on my button box where I can just turn it on and off, you know. I know I've done that as well. Now I can bind it. Today, when I turned the computer back on, I could then bind it. Because what, so what what was nice was being able to. You haven't left the actual Glasgow, have you? I'm just going for my job. Oh, right. How many miles were you then? Uh, 27. Ah, right. Okay. I thought you would. I thought you'd followed me to the garage. No, no. I was getting my own job. Ah, I assumed because it was the uh, tubes. It would be the same place. No. No, I'm just parked in Glasgow with mine. So where have you gone to then? Uh, I'll tell you when I can look on the map. Actually, because I could do with fuel. Yeah, we're actually going uh, okay. north out of Glasgow, so we've got to come back down. Yeah, so, so you're, go stick... you're going up the way and then back down. So when you come yeah. back down, we'll, we'll, we'll set off. Yeah, there's, so if there's you can no just point now. Yeah, if you can entertain yourself for a bit. But what I might do something. is I might turn around and go because it's getting us out of diff out the way, the shortest way. But I could really do with fuel, so I'm gonna go. Yeah. And There's get one to the fuel. Yeah, I know. Yeah. Yeah. That's and I'm, what I went to. I'll meet you there when you come back. You see. I have literally got no fuel, like. As I said, I, could, I thought you'd followed me out, and I pulled into the petrol station, and uh, I just assumed it was yourself next to me. Because I, I assumed we were going to the same place, but obviously I uh, assumed wrong. Again, a uh, massive hello to everybody. I uh, missed so much people there while I've been chatting. Not too bad yourself. Uh, oh yeah, if you've got single screen, it, it, it's, it's got to be a must, I think. Uh, and, I, and I thought it was anyway, because I'd used the, the eye track thing in the past. Yeah. Uh, and, and I could see how good that was going to be. It's, it's, I tell you, I found it really strange. I found it strange to start with. And I tell you what I can't get over is how much I move my head. Yeah, well, I, I'm not as bad as yourself because of the GoPro. Uh, well, I, I was coming to that. Yeah, so. I was, uh, it made me realise, I thought. But I tell you what, even leaning when you're going around the corner and trying to get a bit of, find a bit of grip, it was, it just felt that little bit extra. Yeah, I, the only thing so, I did have to do on the racing games was invert the roll. You know, the head uh, roll when you, when you uh, tilt left. Well, I'm, you, I'm pleased you've told me that because I raced and when I leaned one way, I'm, I'm going the wrong way. So. Yeah, you need to invert the roll. So, I've got quite a few bits that I've uh, I've got to get sorted and I'll, uh, I'll get there. No, I'm loving it. Like it's uh, again. What I do like though is when I'm getting out on the motorway, I can just hit the off button, and then just look around my room and just chill. Yeah, well, I, there's another thing that it's got. I don't know whether you're already using it. You can fix the pause. Ah. So, say for argument's sake, you know when you want to look down. Yeah. And, uh, and you think, ah, right, that's exactly where I want it. You can fix it. Ah, so then you can just look left and right then. No, then it just stays. You know, oh like right! Oh yeah! Yeah yeah! I got you! Yeah. You get on the motorway and you might think, right? I want to be able to see my uh, dials and all that. So you just hit the button to say fix my pause, and it stays put. Brilliant! Until you hit that button again. Right, I'm gonna try and go and park up somewhere because you you'll be coming down the country with me anyway. Yeah yeah exactly. Yeah. So if I if I can go and get up on the motorway and then park up. Yeah. And then I can use my flight cam so I can uh, check That's everyone out, yeah. I don't know if everyone knows, I uh, I got my uh, DAF um, shifter and Man. it's brilliant. Yeah. So a massive, massive thanks to Mark and Al Mark for that. Man shifter though, mate. It, oh sorry, man, yeah. what did I say? DAF. I've echo. Or oh, DAF, DAF, sorry. Did you, no, did I meant... you, someone would ask, oh, are they making DAF now? <laughs> Oh yeah, it's it's from a daft driver. Yeah. But yeah, highly recommend it, as always. Sound is pulsing in and out. Okay. Ooh. My dad's is definitely yeah. It's just his internet. Oh again, I thought it'd been not too bad today oh, as well. It was the same 
just earlier your camera was freezing. It's not massive, an issue. Dis massive disappointment for me today. I couldn't get my hours in on Forza. I couldn't get I one. I got a bit done. I got the 19. Happy. Yeah, I've got the Goliath unlocked. And I've been round it once before I went to bed last what's, night. What's so. your thoughts on it? Yeah, really good. Yeah, I mean... Um, I think you got to go around it. I was tired anyway, so I've got to go. You've probably got to go around it and revisit it, you know, and just uh, yeah, give it another try, like you know. But yeah, it's good. I mean, they've got the obviously they've got the parts where you've got a uh, for the faster cars, obviously. So yeah. Yeah, for some of the rally cars, I would almost say the Colossus is probably better to do. Right. The rally car, the rally cars, and low gear, you know, like where they get to the speed fast, but they, they top out early. It's probably good to start with at the start of the map when you go around Ambleside and that. Yeah. But once you've been out around the dales and that, you come back into the sort of town area. But it is good, and then out onto the other coast road, which is really nice. Kind of feels like, well, I was just feeling like it would be like going around the Isle of Man, you know. Ah, <laughs> uh, right, yeah, I got you. Obviously, I know it's not, but I kind of felt like that, so... Uh, just a shout-out, if everyone can just pull up nice and cleanly on the hard shoulder. Would be awesome. There's a fair few of us in tonight, so if we can just uh, keep it calm and collected, would be lovely. Nice, chill yeah. drive. Sorry, you're all waiting for ourselves coming from the uh, quarry. So... Right, Mr. Dave's in tonight. Dave for Logistics, Dave. yeah. Oh, what, is he coming for a drive? I think so, he's got a helicopter on. Unless he's going flying, but... Nice to... Nice to see you out, Dave. Got to say. I hope Jade's still doing well. She must be uh, ready to burst. <laughs> Can I say that? No. Sorry, Dave. He's looking for she a parking spot. I should say, she should be at that blooming stage that they go to. I think there's some of them down here, I think. It's quite a spread out convoy. Yeah, well, Jake and a couple of the other lads... Uh, well, I quite like, there's a pink, there's a brown Scania. Which is quite nice, like a grey brown. And there's also Malky's truck looking nice. Yeah, Gambler's gone for the uh, yeah, blue boy. wrapper tonight. I went... With I went like a grey blue. Ah right, well your your uh, main man's gone for a, a, a really blue wrapper with some black accent on it. Ah. So that's what he's gone for. Uh, hiya Dominic and the, everybody else who's signed in. Oh candy shoes, that sounds good. Oh, got me new monster finally. Got a couple of cans today. Ah, were you were you allowed? The pink, yeah. Oh, have you heard from uh, Richard? I, Not I didn't really. see him yesterday. No, I didn't see him yesterday, so just he, he, uh, he must be wiped out though. Phew, I tell you what, can't. Uh, I was telling your mum, and it's hard to get over how far that is to drive. Like that's. Where were you, that man? Just coming out the quarry now. Jesus. Hiya Glenn. Hiya Glenn. How do? How do? Ooh. Right. Fa oh, sorry, sorry can I, uh, Adam, uh, <coughs> anyone else listening? Sorry. We're heading across to Christian Sand first and then up to Oslo. Yeah, K uh, Kieran, yeah, thanks. Uh, is he following us in the police I don't car? Think so, no. No. Yes, no. everything's absolutely fine, buddy. Yeah, going well. I did have a police car following us the other day, but I couldn't hear an absolute anything. I, They're so loud, I, man. I don't know whether Kieran know if I don't know if he's aware of how noisy they oh, are. I, I don't know why that happens. I think everyone knows they've always been noisy ever since he launched them. Yeah, so, sorry, and uh, Adam and everyone else have not really had a chance to talk to. No, I was going to say popped into. Uh, just needed some boxes and that for moving, obviously. And yeah. uh, popped into B and M today. There's two engines for the car. The new one is very noisy. Yeah, I know. Ah, it is ridiculous. Got you, buddy. But yeah, pop yeah. Go, go on. on. No, no, go on. No, no. I, I, I was just going to say what were you saying? Yeah. Yeah, we as I say, we popped into B and M, 
you know, shop just like a, a cheaper shop, you know. Yeah, yeah. Uh, and they had the wallpaper ran flooring in there, so we found flooring was lighter than I wanted actually. But then, in essence, it'd probably be a good thing. Ah, right, yeah, yeah. You know, so but oh, I didn't, I didn't, no. I didn't ah. know. Someone tip you. I've, no, I've tipped myself. I was hurrying. Ah. There's no hurry, like. No, I was. I, I was just trying to get me. It'd been slow pulling them pipes, and I just thought, oh, I'll. Uh, yeah, I was going to say, because you bought like laminate before, but the one you put in Oakfield was quite good stuff, wasn't it? Yeah, again, tried to go for um, so something that wa wasn't... Uh, I didn't know if I, if uh, £17 a pack was dear or cheap. Like, I've looked at <sighs> B&Q and that, and some of them are like 30 40 quid a pack, and I was like, that'd be yeah. like four or 500 quid to do a room. Well, you know the ones, the one, one in the house you've got at the moment? Yes. You, you know that that if uh, if you if someone said that does not scratch with dogs on it, yeah, and you, you you've you've physically seen that, so oh yeah, but I want cheap. I don't want the. Uh, that that's what so, I'm saying. I have, I have looked around and it's seventeen seems around about quite so cheap. I don't I don't want expensive. That's the point. So I'm I'm pretty sure that's gonna be fine yeah Why? Right, we're just leaving Glasgow now mate if yeah. that's any help to you we're just parked on the motorway still so sorry everyone I uh, as soon as it went over I thought you tool <laughs> right so yeah I mean I, I well put it let's put it out there to everyone who's uh, who's yeah. What laminate and that, you know, what's... There's a question for any, any homeowners. Is £17 a pack for laminate any good? Is that too expensive? Can you get stuff that's a lot cheaper, or...? I'm going to say you can get cheaper. Yeah. So I'm, I'm just putting it out there that what you've just suggested would probably be fairly decent stuff. Right, because I just want grey. That's the only thing. I don't want that orangey, orky. Right. Because obviously, if it is, it, it's the white balance on the cameras. It's a nightmare. Yeah. So, too cheap yeah, from my experience. Twenty-five is decent. Yeah. Well, Joseph, I want cheap. That's the point. It wants, it wants cheap. Yeah. I, I, I want to try and keep the, the the build fairly cheap. It's going to get. It's not going to have dogs in it. It's not going to have animals in it. It's going to have two rigs in it, and that's about it. So it, it doesn't need to do anything. It doesn't need to be hard yeah. wearing or anything like that. So. Uh, Hunter. That's a very good deal, buddy. Three three seventy euro for a, a version two. Like that's what I've got. That's a, yeah, it's about right. Yeah, two fifty. So, you can get them two fifty or three hundred. You can get them for. So I was going to say I, I don't think anyone's had your eyes out over that at no, all. No, very good. You let us know when you're here. Yep, yeah, I'm just coming up the ramp now, mate. Ah, there you are. Finally. Sorry about that, everybody. Just one of them. Here he comes with all these flashy beacons on. <laughs> and me, and me, uh, oh, I didn't, I didn't, I was supposed to pick a man, I've gotten for daft. Right, you, you, uh, I'll follow you. Okay. Sorry everybody. My, my, my bad. Oh, your truck's looking quite nice actually. Ah, I was going to get up beside you so I could show you it once, oh. uh, once we're on the road. Yeah, will do. Just to see what you think of the colour. Uh, quite like it actually. I was going grey, but it's kind of like a bluey grey. Yeah, I, 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 I say I definitely don't. Uh, there's such a lot of things that you know when you mess about, you can say, oh yeah, I quite like that, you know. Yeah, you're sticking to fifty, yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna stick to fifty when I can reach fifty. Yeah, yeah, it's not a fast truck that one, is it? It isn't. I'm very, very surprised. I don't know what end. It might have been one of them that we uh, did a challenge in or something. I don't know. I just picked I it and went. Ah, I'm, I'm the same. This is the one I was used yesterday with Hutch, you see. So I actually like the colour. I, li I like this. Um, yeah, it's like a, it's like a dark green. But also the uh, the grey with the other green at the. Oh, yeah, that is nice, that. Isn't it? Isn't it nice right. for the pink? Because yeah, I, I, I quite liked it over the black. Because black is just not very, you know. It's just a bit of black, isn't it? But I quite liked it. It is. 
Yeah, yeah, nice shot. I'll, I'll let you back past. I was just just to show you. Yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah, Joseph. I think Mark will, will have a look around Wix and B and Q. I didn't actually ask where he'd actually gone to to have a look. B and M. That's what I was saying. B and M. Oh, sorry, you did it's, say B and M. It's a cheaper store. store. Yeah. Right, so really, uh, you can get cheaper because my dad got his twenty-five. Yeah, but I'm, mine was 17, 1, 7, 17 a pack. Well, 16.50 a pack it was. Uh, that's what it was, and that was for eight pieces, so. Yeah. I just, I don't know, because I know you can get really cheap, like, i.e., uh, you know, like the stuff you get in some, I don't, don't want to say how bad, but like death, doctor's surgeries and that, you know, that, it's that bright, it's not oak, is it? It's, uh yeah, beach, um, you know, like our beach. Beach, beach. And yeah. that that just wouldn't go well in here. It needs to be a neutral colour. So obviously, as soon as you try and change the colour from something cheap, they're gonna put more money on it. Obviously. Yeah. Uh, but well, if, if anyone's got any links or anything, or they find out, just just face put me them because it would be a help. It's something that I do need to buy. So it's not a uh, oh I fancy changing it. It's a, I have to buy it for moving in. So. Again, I uh, I don't know what Florence goes down well. Uh, quick quick step is a good uh, ready as, sort of assembly floor, and uh, mine was a bit of a pain the one we put down. Yeah. But you kind of don't know till you've tried putting it together, and then the way I wanted to lay mine, where it was all through the house. I know. Took a bit of wangling, but um, Cheryl's the first lot I ever did was a nightmare. You had to knock it together. Yeah. Well, I, I don't know what this one is, but to be honest, I'm not too concerned because I've got David, Hutchie and Sean. Well, that's so true. I'm not, you know, I mean, David's stuff, the holiday yeah. cottages they're building is stupid, like top end. Yeah. So I'm not concerned on that front. It'll no. just be whatever deal I can get. Uh, and I got the wallpaper from there as well, which was eight pound a, ro a, a roll. So they've got the, the, the paper that I want in as well. So they're not too bad. That's good. We were kind of quoting really about 150 for each, is what we were kind of thinking in our heads. Yeah. So, you know, kind of, I'm going to measure it when we go down for the keys. Uh, but yeah, we were kind of thinking 150 floor and 150 to do the walls. And I'm yeah. lucky because I'm not having to pay labour, so. You know. Yeah. Right, is Twin Cam in, is he? Or is it Twin Cam Gaming? Ah, Twin it's Cam Gaming, twin, how are you twin doing? Cam Gaming, I've not yeah. seen I've not seen Mr. William for a while. No, I haven't. I take it uh, I take it he's good. Yeah. I man. was I, I was saying to him, you know that obviously you, you had the cold but worse than me, obviously, but the I was saying to William, I hope it's doesn't get on his chest this kind of stuff because uh, he's bad anyway. I was going to say I think the last time he'd said that he'd said well that's what he's like all the time. E exactly yeah. and uh, I mean I, I really felt from him because I, I was... I take uh, it you can't get to 50. I'm I'm at 50 now. Yeah you come past me. Okay. I was uh, I've been I was wanting to let you back past again I was only up beside you to show you the... Right, that's me at 57. Oh, yeah. Hi everybody. Yeah, I'm only doing 45, so you'll get past us like. Let us know when I'm past. Yeah, you're past. I'll go back down to 50. Yeah. Alright, uh, but yeah, I hope everyone's had a good Monday. I've still like, well, not I didn't do any of the driving or anything. Uh, <laughs> I just think it was, took it right out of us, uh, being away. Love the minion. Cheers, Jamie. This is Kev, made by my mum. Yeah, she's it. Oh, she's good at it, like. So she's making the next one, which is Stuart, and that's going in uh, my daughter, that's Mark's sister, in her car, back of her car, so he can... Uh... Right, I've got Joseph's in with, will the floor be taking heavy weight, only because the cheaper stuff could chip and crack? I know, well... The really bog standard cheap stuff that I found on eBay was like six quid a pack. That was like, that's the cheapest I could find. So I thought, you know, I, I thought the, 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 the grey floor that I found possibly, if anyone else has found anything else grey, cheaper than yeah. 17 a pack, just drop us a message on Facebook. But I don't think weight's an issue because the whole room's getting wood floored, well, laminate, and then 
the two corners where both rigs are going is then getting four matten down like what my dad's got yeah then really the rigs good. go on top of them so I don't yeah. think even if it did crack underneath you wouldn't see it so yeah. I don't think that side of it's a, a worry really uh, but again until you've done it you don't really know do you but I'm not, not spending a lot on a floor that you know it's no. purely just for gaming and someone was asking what floor I've got in now uh, it's just carpet but it's it is like a, a cream but it's like an off cream and it's something I've always wanted to change but again the new the new room is bright red like 70s red yeah. that, that type you know what I mean <laughs> that velvety I mean, yeah, yeah. Uh, 17 quid but cheers Joseph much appreciated simulating uh, I just going to say, that, I was waiting to see her. That confused me then. I uh, only seen <laughs> one of you at a time. Ah, yeah, well, that's my dad, obviously. Yeah. Uh, and I'm over in this corner, but I do turn myself off uh, just to give, you know, so people can see the gear changing and that. So. Some tight corners coming, lads. If I, you've, uh... I was in your Forza stream. I did say hello, but you did ignore me again. But it's fine. I'm getting used to it now. <laughs> like the face cam though, man. Uh, si we simulate playing. Um, ah, he was. Four to four. Yeah, he's got yeah. a track. He's got a tat tra uh, tat track, whatever they are. Track oh, right. Oh, so clip the same as us. Um, uh, simulate. Have you got yours to work okay in Project Cars Two? We've we've read about it. Uh, yeah, but it, it definitely says, works. Yeah, it, we just are something we haven't. We're not doing or something, you know. No, no, I, I, we know how to work it now, though. Oh, yeah, was that... Uh, what yeah. did it say we had to do? First, I'll, uh, I'll send you it when you get over, but it works. Yeah. Don't, yeah, yeah uh, you, you, you are bad at reading chat, but yeah, he plays farm sim and that. He doesn't really play. Oh, right. Well, oh, farm sim's great for reading chat. Oh, I mean... No. I've, he's on about... I've, I was saying for the head track, he plays farming and that, so... Oh, right, I'm with you. He's, right. o he's only ever played it in VR project cars too. I tell you what, mind. Last night when I tried the uh, the hat thing, when I got it to work a little bit, uh, in in the tractor was brilliant. Well, it does work well in the tractor. Oh, a I mean, anything yeah. that doesn't have true triple sc screen support, it worked really well in. Nah, that's okay, simulator. No, no problem. I just. Uh, I, I was actually assuming that you'd actually played. Uh, I shouldn't have assumed, but no. I mean, I think it's very good. I mean, we haven't got VR, obviously, but we've got to try it. And um, you know, oh, yeah, you, you it's, it's nowhere near VR, but it's not. Uh, it's not trying to be. No, and that's what I was. Uh, we were trying to get across to say it's not to replace anything. It's to add to your your, your gear. So, uh, it probably, I, I'm going to try it in the bus sim. Yeah, it probably will work. I would think. We'll we'll, we'll give it another go because obviously we said until they got the track um, the thingy sorted. So. Yeah. Yeah, but I would say it would work. I think. Yeah. Uh, Harry, we're in uh, server. No, oh, no, not uh, sorry, Stuart. We're in server three, buddy. And Harry. Ah, right, that's the one you're asking there. Right. It does work in bus sim, yeah. I'd prefer rig like yours than VR. VR really isn't there yet. Uh, yeah, it's one of them things. It depends what type of person you are. Uh, if you're just after experience, VR is there. And if you only just do racing or flying, you're just doing a set thing. Yeah. It, it is there and it, and it, it, it can be fully usable uh, f certainly for racing I found yeah. it you were comp you go from screens to that and all of a sudden you're competitive and you're not I mean it's that different mm. uh, a field of VR players is completely different than racing a field of people on screens but again it does uh, take away the gaming side of it because it makes it the, that step forward more realistic yeah. and sometimes we don't want that we want to chill no. Put your feet up, watch, watch, the, telly. watch the telly, radio, yeah, yeah, and, and, and just relax. So don't say radio. Right, anybody who wants to join us, we've just we're on the A68, uh, and we've just crossed into England. So 
you go, we're going to go past Newcastle, heading down towards Grimsby before we head to uh, Norway. If that's what, if you're looking for us. Ah, Dean is in there. Yeah, I was going to say you were going to say obviously you could listen to the radio, but you could do that in VR. Yeah. Oh, of course, yeah. Yeah, well, yeah. You're right, Dan. <laughs> Matt. Yeah, never, yeah. Yeah. Matt, there's a website called Online Carpets and they have grey laminate floor. Oh, well, send us a. Send us a thing through, uh, through my Facebook thing because I just I'll forget. But that that's like ten quid, well more than ten, yeah, ten quid cheaper. So yeah, yeah. Because the trick is to check what the square meter and all that is. Because obviously if if that's half the amount you get in in a bigger pack, obviously then you know. So yeah, send us it through and I'll uh, I'll have a look. So I need to try and get try and get something done for next week really. Yeah. So. Yeah, that's. Uh, I've tried to find me light. I know. I've just was thinking. I normally use. I've been using my BM wheel for trucking. Yeah. And of course, I've left my little wheel on because I've been messing about, and I'm thinking, oh, my buttons are missing. Where? What have I done now? <laughs> <laughs> I just realised that I, different wheel on. Yeah. <coughs> it doesn't take much to confuse me. Right. Uh, although I really enjoy Elite Dangerous, yeah. Uh, a really relaxing game. I know. Have you still got your VR then? Have you actually got a VR headset then, Simulate? Right, uh, how are you both? Hey, Jaffa, you're really good, mate. Absolutely spot on, buddy. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, that'd be interesting as well. I mean, not only uh, Simulate, but anyone who has got the VR who thought they would use it non stop, but is kind of not using it as much as what they thought. Yeah, I mean. A few of the ones I've come across like that tend to just sell them on, you know, because, you know, they are very viable. Mm. Yeah, I mean, I, I, I know I'm like Mark, I, I would I would have one to enhance my, you know, because I'm yeah. very fortunate. I can just play for a couple of hours, well, an hour on, you know, if you had that on, play iRacing. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to try that head track. I've got to try it on a carb cup. Oh, yeah. Oh, it'd be good, like. Uh, I think it'll be it'll be weird, but uh, yeah. You saw a carpet for nine ninety nine, right? That's I don't even know what I'm so long out of the. Um, no, I don't. I don't. Line, I, don't so. I don't want to put carpet down. No, at all. I, I won't put carpet down. I am J Modern. It's, uh, right, when is your window button? Yeah, I think they're talking to each other. Yeah, did you realise that? But, yeah, so it's a really good ex experience getting things working, you know, and then when you see how good it can be, you're like, so in, in race room, I know it's going to work, but you told me about, when I was tipping my head, I thought, well, that's really w weird. But <laughs> yeah. I keep forgetting it's like the mouse, where you can invert it, but... I, yeah, I know. I'm just not that quick off the mark now. I, no, I, we, I know. We, Hey Dave, uh, moving well to the northeast uh, to about nine days. So is is the official? That'll be where Hutchie will come down with a van and we'll start doing it. So uh, yes, it will. Yeah, anonymous. Yeah, it'll make it very echoey. Yeah. Evening uh, truck nuts. So, uh, how much are you away Wednesday? Are you are coming back on Wednesday, aren't Wed you? Wednesday yeah. night, yeah. Last interview is at half six, so by the time we go to right. Sean's and set off. Yeah. Because, uh, so, I need to go and talk to Sean, but obviously that's who's primarily helping me with the actual move financially, so uh, I need to go and chat to him. I don't like talking about stuff like that over the phone. Nope. No, no, no so, not at all. Well, I'll definitely be on with everyone tomorrow night from nine at uh, Aberdeen and our normal place on Wednesday at, at Italy. Yeah. Um, if I can get on during the day, I will. Tomorrow I've got something to do. Yeah. Uh, if I can get back in time, I will see if I can do something. No, honestly, not next week. The week after, so. honestly, Dad, I wouldn't even panic. There's going to be that little content on. Yeah. Uh, I, I would not. Panic, just just do what you've happy doing and, and, and that'll be it. Yeah. 
Well, I'm not used to being on in the night. Well, especially when I pack my room up and if we kind of get our hands on the floor and that and it takes a month or so, if you're on a lot, all you'll get is, where's Mark, where's Mark, right, where's Mark? And that, that isn't enjoyable either, because I've no. had it with yourself, so... Yeah, yeah just, I know what you mean. As I say, we'll, we'll, we'll see how it plays out. Yes, uh, William, I, I can echo that... Uh, uh, congratulations on the move and how he, he did have a mini fridge. I don't know whether we still got it. No, I lost it in the garage. We lost all our electricals and stuff yeah, like that. Yeah. Remember when we were flooded? Absolutely, yeah, yeah, yeah. I just yeah went to sit. Went to the same place as the T500 to skip. <laughs> Unfortunately, such a, it is it one of them? It's such a shame when you got to throw stuff out, isn't well, it? <laughs> brand new T150 as well. Brand new. Never used. <laughs> So, hey Stuart, right, we, uh, we're we heading to Christian Sand and Oslo yeah. via Grimsby. So, if you are wanting to catch up with us before we leave England, go to Grimsby. Yeah. Uh, Billy Playford, do you remember me from last night? Um, just trying to think if I, if I saw your name. I did. I remember right. you, mate. Uh, so anonymous, yeah. So you're pointing out something very, very crucial, and it will it will create a very echoey atmosphere. However, it's something I'll just need to overcome because I'm going to have multiple people in the room. Uh, carpet just isn't a viable option. So that that's that's all it is. People with drinks, you know, just just general shoes on. You know, you're yep. you're racing a lot. People can't use the pedals. Some people really struggle with their feet. So it just needs to be a non-carpet place. It just has to be. Or yeah. I can put a rug down. I can put curtains on. Anything that's replaceable. But this, the, the main floor needs to be wood. This this clipped together flooring that you put down. I mean, it's so cleanable. Yeah. It, you know, if you add that on top of that, are you capture? Well, that's just going under my rig. You won't actually see that because my rigs are square. You, oh, of course, yeah. You know, yeah. it'll go under the under the actual channels, but you, I don't think you'll see them much. Not like yours, because yours is a bit of a, a an yeah, odd shape. Yeah, odd shape, yeah. So yeah, uh, simulates uh, you know acoustic foam for the walls. That I'm kind, of, I'm trying to get a sponsor, because you'll know uh, if you're talking about it. It is bloody dear that stuff, man. Is, is it? Yeah, and the other the other issue you have is attaching it to the bloody wall. Is you need to use adhesive. Yeah. Well. Obviously, that leaves residue on the wall. Oh, it, oh, and would, some I? of the ones I've seen in some of the big setups that I've seen are uh, unreal, terrible when they take it down. So I don't know how I'm sorting that yet, but again, I'll definitely sort it. And all that stuff's fixable once the room's done. But I won't know until it's done. Yeah. And as you say, you, you, you come across these things, don't you? And yeah. Ah, as I say, just I know with at least Sean and, 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 and Hutchie being in, all it takes is to knock a can over or anything oh, like that, and the carpet's ab, ab, just ab, ridiculously hard to look absolutely. after. Absolutely. And myself, to be fair, I drop stuff all the time. Well, so. gonna, I was going to say, yeah. No, it's so easy to do. Ah, you Vectrum, yeah, all good here. Sound absorbing pain, nice one. <laughs> I've not got the fastest truck on the market tonight, everyone. I'm sorry about that. It's a DAF 105 slow. Uh, right, ah, okay, uh, Dave. Dave. Yeah, got you there, buddy. That's a good yeah. idea. Thanks for I'll that. confirm now. Uh, dot the sign. Not yet. Uh, however, the application has all gone through, so credit checks. All the major stuff has gone through. All we're waiting for is confirmation that Emma works where she works, and that's it done. So we're still yeah. set to get the keys on the 19th. So unless Emma's company comes back and says she doesn't work there, which she does, all the things that we could have failed that are unfixable, i.e. credit checks, stuff like that, that's all done. So we're actually even going to put our notice in tomorrow because Although it could still technically, we're not actually signed, but I just can't see that the last thing that we're waiting for, how that would be an issue. Yeah. So we're just going to do it because it's getting to the point where we're going to own this house for too long. Uh, Joey, we're always on till uh, 11 o'clock on, on an evening. 
yeah. Engli e England time. Which will change soon. Yeah. Can't wait, man. Back to two. <laughs> well, especially with Hutchie on the weekend. Absolutely, yeah. That's what it's all about. Good. Uh, twin cam. They're just chatting to each other. Oh, yeah, yeah, sorry. Ah, right, uh, someone's asking about the, when does the mile limit reset on trucks book? It's start of the month, isn't it? Start of the month, yeah. So it would be the first of the first, I would imagine, I think. Oh, yeah, yeah. Mr. Twin Cam would be more, uh, yeah, I, just, I would say the first of the first, I would think. <laughs> yeah, the timetable is on until 2 a.m. That's made everyone's day. <laughs> oh no, that that that's one of the points of the new move is is to bring back the late night. So yeah, Abu, see you later, buddy. Have a good. One. There's Kieran just uh, sitting in the background. That's good. Uh, what's the knocking sound? I don't know. I don't think it's coming from my end. It's not. It's not my uh... shifter. <laughs> Shift that. I don't not that I have to change very often. But no, well the splitter you won't use much. I wouldn't. No, think. it's just a range. Yeah. Yeah. Don't get me wrong. If you're struggling, like uh, from a uh, a pulling stuff point of view, using the splitter is what it's there for. All right. I mean, I'm. Uh, you know. Do, doing what I did with the buttons and getting ready for it was the yeah. best thing I could have done. Uh, oh yeah, because your brain understands what the point is. Yeah. Totally got got I got totally round it all. So uh, right, to a detached house then, but yeah, it's a, it's a, it's an end uh, he's nah. going to. So and it's a good end as well. Yeah, yeah I was just, <laughs> I was just going to say primarily yes, it's detached. There, there isn't a bedroom or anything attached to another house. So the boi the boiler room and the kitchen I think or the hallway that's the only bit that's attached so primarily it is uh, detached you would think if I told you yeah. it was an end terrace you would you would think it's not an end you, you wouldn't think what it actually is uh, Frutex fr yes uh, by all means we're just coming into Grimsby now so anyone's welcome don't have to be in a company at, at all nope so just come for the ride out if you need if you want to. We do prefer everyone to have a trailer just through, through you know yeah. but sensibility again, and you, 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 there's no reason for anyone not to have a trailer now even if it's empty. Yeah, exactly. So, hey John, how's it going? Ah, there's the main man there. Ah, How are you, buddy? This is yeah, it's called the uh, Pipeline Punch. And I'd never seen it before either because I thought it was sugar free when I first saw it and I was like, ah oh, no, I'm not bothering with that. But it isn't, and it's like my favourite flavour now. Is it? Yeah. Oh yeah. Absolutely. I wonder if you can get a car skin with that because there's uh, my R5 Fiesta. I got there was a, a car skin monster. Uh, it's like a yellow and uh, chrome, you know, like a oh, silver. Right, okay. That that's quite nice. That. I, I presume that's off a monster. I would think, yeah, it'd be the, the Ripper's black and... Uh, but looks really, really nice. That truck in front of you's got a nice job on it, hasn't it? Yeah, it's... Uh, nice, though, I is it? Is he driving for Blizzard? It's Jake. Ah. Now, I don't know if he's driving for Blizzard. Uh, I'm not sure. I can't, I can't see, because... Again, he's got a dark blue, you know, when you like your name. Yeah, when it, it you can't read it easily off the board. Ah uh, no. So I I think you've made it messed up there, but that's just my opinion. No, oh, I've never changed it for three years since I started I playing MP. So. Oh, uh, simulates asking if you've tried the. I haven't, mate. No, I was just waiting for me dad to finish so I can say bye to John. I hope you, yeah, I hope you enjoy job. enjoying your France trip, mate, and uh, thanks for popping in on your holidays. I appreciate it. Is, is he going on his own? Oh, sorry, he, he's, in going on your own he's in France. He's in France now. That's why I'm thanking him for coming in. 
Yes, he's he's gone with the lads. Oh, no Ellie. Nope. Oh, he's going fishing, isn't he? Yeah. Well, sorry. That's the front they're using, aren't they? Yeah. They've put the front fishing. So we, we're going over to... Es Esborg. Yeah, I thought that. Yes, Lewis, but uh, I haven't done a convoy since last Tuesday with my dad. And also, uh, I'm going away for job interviews with uh, Emma tomorrow uh, and Wednesday. So my next convoy would have been Friday and I just wanted to go trucking with my dad for a bit, so. Yep. So, that's what we do. Do you not have DLC, Mark, so you can not go with you? Okay, Jake, yep, see you later, buddy. Don't forget, I'm trying to let everyone out, but everyone's just driving through me. Uh, Yeah, Jake, we always say that people, if you want to join our, any of our convoys, you need at least the Gone East and the Scandinavian DLC, so. That was Jake with a nice truck in front of me. Ah, well, that's a shame. But totally well, understand if you haven't been able to get it, buddy. Cal but oh, Callum, you're on the wrong side of the road, Jesus Christ. Uh, Roberto, yes, uh, we haven't got track IR, yeah, we've got uh, track at. Yeah. And uh, use the clip for the side of the headphones. So, we got to pick them up on. Uh, you went left, that's I take it, did you? Did go left, mate, yeah, yeah, sorry. Yeah, we picked them up on Saturday after being able to sort of see them working. And no, yeah, it's good. It is good when you lean forward now, because your mum was quite surprised when she had a look and, you know, you can have a look at the dashboard and that, you know. Oh, it's, it's very good, like. I, I love it. Uh, I'd say I've been using mine most of the night. I'd say I turn it off on the streets and that so I can actually look around if I'm like grabbing my vape or something like that, you know? Yeah. But well, have a look at that um that port that um Oh, what's it called? I don't it, know. It, it it freezes your uh, paws, you know, you Oh yeah I will. Yeah, I'll look at that. Yeah. Great, you just look at one part where you want to look at and it just freezes it, it's brilliant. So I, I, I think when you when you start finding out little bits and you think it's really clever, really well thought of. And it is simple, isn't it? Oh, it really is. Again, my setup with the four screens and such like that, there's definitely, I've caused a problem for it. But if you had yeah. one screen and a, and a wheel and a, quite a yeah. simple, set up but yeah it is a, a very easy thing there's obviously uh, certain things like Microsoft Flight Sim X there's a different protocol you need to use than than this so there's certain things like that uh, with project cars and that as well that like it's just going to be learning you know yeah so what's it called I, I need this uh, it's called track hat is what it's actually called so if you type track hat into Google you'll see that they do a physical hat that you can put on your head and also they do this clip that I have, uh, so I can actually I can show you it. So it's just Velcro. Yeah, there you go. That's it. It's just a clip. It picks up that camera picks it up. So if I turn it back on while I'm holding this, oh, hang on. It's yeah, wireless so, as well. Oh, he stops faster than I could. It's got, I just got tipped. But yeah, as you can see with the view, you tilt the clip and you move it forward and back. That's me, I've got to go out with a red spanner. Right, so, yeah, we'll, we'll, very, we'll pull very over simple. once we know where you are. Yeah, I tried, I tried to stop, but someone just drove straight in the back of us, unfortunately. Yeah. It's not a lot I can do. Where, I, don't know, I don't know who it was that actually wrote us off. Callum, I think. Uh, sounds about right. I thought it was Gambler, because he was behind us. Okay. Jay for the win, I Mark, uh, chat. Yeah, all doing good. But yeah, I mean that that, that clip you can actually, uh, you know, if it, you can actually charge it while you're using it as well. So I don't, I just don't think you would need to. You know, hey, we one of them things. How often you use it, and that if you just charge it now and again, it'll be fine. Yeah, yeah. I charge all It'll my stuff just... every night anyway, like so. Yeah. It's just easy, I've done it with my headphones since I got them and I've never had them die on stream yet. Evening Lee James, uh, where are you tonight?
Ah, that's funny to use as old PSR. Yeah. Yeah, it's been modified uh, from as Charles. As from what we know, I don't know what they've done to it. Or yeah, they did take the lens out. There's, or a, something. there's a protective film on one of the lenses. It's like a, an anti glare or something. It should, if you go on the website, they actually show you what they do. Which is pretty cool. Uh, but yeah, it's just a small piece of lens. Like, a, a lens isn't just one piece of glass, it has different steps in it. And they take one of them out, that's it. But I did look at the strip down on the camera on uh, Google, uh, YouTube, and it's not an easy thing to, you know. So. That was Joshua, so I, I've got to uh, apologise to Callum. It wasn't Callum, it was Joshua, so. Yeah, I had me, I would have put my name on Gambler, so. But just but because. Massive. Callum went right, so we went left. Ah, yeah. Massive apologies to Callum, and I, I didn't even know because I couldn't see, so I shouldn't have said anything. No, when we came out the red spanner, Callum crashed into someone and then turned right, and then we all went left. Uh, you know, at the ferry place, yeah. opposite the red spanner. So, so uh, uh, where, yeah, yeah look, where have you? Where, sorry, where, back to where I was. Right, so we, we, we we'll pull over. Because, um. Oh, yeah, you definitely have to stop if you carry on. I'll never catch up with you. You said you were pulling over. Yeah, I must admit, I, I didn't, and I was. Uh, I forgot. We're just going to find a service bit and we'll. Uh, Even just on the grass will do, like. Everyone can pull over once you've got no barriers there, you know. I know. I've just missed the perfect straight to a pulled over one, but there's, ah. Ah, there's, a, there's a pulling bit here, so we'll go in there. My bad, I was away with the fairies. Trucking away. A steering wheel play fair. Um, I'm not sure which one's Mark's using, but he'll tell you. Fnatic V1? Uh, I don't know, he's on about the actual wheel or the um, on the wheel base. I don't know. He just said it's Fnatic. Wheel. It's, it's, it's all in the description. Right, there you go. Right, I'm going to pull over here, lads. So um, please don't crash. Please don't crash into me. Pull over and wait for Marky. I will put my hazard lights on, but oh yeah, there you go. I remembered where they were. It's not like you. Yeah. I know. I'm not sure how many trucks are with us with me, so I'll, uh, I think I've left enough room there. Let anyone let me know at the back if I haven't left enough room for everyone to slot on the end. There, I think I have. Yeah, it is. Uh... Uh, funky chicken. We don't actually take any notice because to be multiplayer, we're on like a. Um, like your modded profile yeah, but I, from what I can remember when I first started my single player profile um, <clears throat> I think I was roughly doing between tw tw you know 10 and 20 thousand a job could, could I just finish saying thank yeah. you to Chris Moore for the nice comment absolutely yeah Yeah. no you just I was literally saying thank you and you just you went straight over the top of us I know it's not a deliberate thing uh, yeah, Chris, you're absolutely right, mate. I, uh, same when I was younger, did a lot with my dad, and it, it is goals. You're right. There's a lot of people uh, say exactly the same. So thanks for that, buddy. I never even saw his comment. Sorry about that. No, it's all right. It was just I literally was saying thank you, Chris, and then you just blasted straight over the top of us. No, didn't. Uh... Not an issue at all. I was just wanting to say thank you, so because otherwise, once you relax, you just forget <laughs> what, what you were gonna do. Oh, a hundred percent. Well, you definitely got some distance, eh? Jesus. Uh, little legs, Mark had to go back to the red spanner, so he, he, he's coming. Right, right on you go. Ah, oh, right, okay, he's here. Right, everyone, uh, honk if you want to go faster.
Evening. Uh, hello, Michael. I've not said hello to Michael tonight. Hiya, Michael. How are we doing? Better than being able to play with your dad like this. Hi, Dave. Um, we are we are very very lucky and. Uh, Richard was saying when we wait the weekend because I, uh, I think sometimes, I don't know, I don't think, don't think it comes across that we uh, we put an act on just to mess about, but we just generally like that. Two trucks coming the other way. So Richard said he had a, you know, keep him entertained while he was away. So, <laughs> but I I didn't have that you see with my my parents unfortunately, but. Oh, cyclist out on the uh, towpath there, well... Ah, right, okay, Michael. Awesome. That that Logitech one that I do use on the stream PC, it, it is very good, like, uh, the, the wireless one with the built-in mouse. It's pretty much the, the, the keyboard that most in racing people use, to be honest. Yeah, Michael, um, he's called Kevin. Yeah, this is so, Kevin, and my dad's got Dave. Dave's brother. I just bought a tracker. Thanks for the info, guys. Oh, well, there you go, Charles. Not like you to mess about. Much appreciated. Yeah, well, if you if you think our influence has been any good, drop them a line. Yeah. Well, you a message. A message or something. Never does any harm, does it? Not at all, no. No, I was just saying message, just I don't know where Charles is from, so you just never know if oh, people know sorry. what Beg your you know, if someone yeah. knows what a line is. Yeah. Uh Dave, I, it, it is quite strange really because uh like I say I never had that I know there's a lot of people didn't uh Mark had quite a few friends who kind of uh stuck around so we all had a bit banter. So I, I feel I was quite lucky that way as well. So you can come past me once you're up to pace, I'll, like. Yeah, I'm on 50 now, so I will when I catch you. So. Okay. Uh, see you later, Twin Cam. And I've also a Simon uh, Farrington said he, he managed to we managed to get his dad on doing a bit of trucking because we gave him a message to head trucking. <laughs> yeah. So, mind you can't make someone enjoy it as. As someone says about going uh, fishing with your dad, I mean, Mark wouldn't have gone fishing with me if I was fishing, so... Nope. Maybe he would have pushed him in the lake where he was fishing, but other than that... Now, if I said, well, look, you can come and build a, a fire, I would have stopped fishing and built a fire with him. Yeah. Because we, uh, we both like a fire. We do indeed. Don't forget, okay. if there's anyone behind me, you can crack on and get past us. I will when I catch you up. Not, not you, I'm one of all the people sitting behind us. Uh, so, yeah, as I say, I'm, I'm looking forward to getting that uh, thing a bit more set up tomorrow. And I've got a little bit further each day, you know, that I've tried. But yeah. sitting in high race when I had it working and you're like going round a little bit more and then you're going to try another uh, car out and I think that's always... You know, like, oh, I'll go and try this, and not necessarily faster, but it was it was strange that I was uh, at least as fast. Yeah, no, I know. And that's when something strange. But parking the parking the lorry with it <laughs> for some reason, like not doing some of the silly mistakes I was making, like hitting some of the curbs and that. I did. I don't know. I could be making it up, but it just did seem to help. No, I, I agree. So... Yeah, and it, it actually is one of them things where you suddenly think, can it be this easy? And I've been missing out. So. I mean, yeah, it, it, something I was quite lucky with my own setup where I just got it about right for parking and that, you know, with the mirrors and that. Yeah. I just It just feels right and I, I've got very good at the parking. And also, like I say, um, noticing how much you like move your head yourself when you're just like fidgeting about, you know. But you've you've learnt that with having the go up. Ah, yeah, I had that learning curve, yeah. So, 
Right, do you guys have all the DLC? Yes. Uh, look forward yeah. to the... The only one I don't have at the moment is the Oregon for ATS, but... Um, You're going to get it. We, we will so we will get it. Yeah, I just need... You just, I've told my dad to leave it this week because I'm just in contact with someone, so... And then when I come back next week, so, well, if we don't have it, then we'll just get it. Yeah. I, I do think they've priced it very, very reasonable. I agree. Uh, at, at, at £9. So... But, yeah, I'll, you know... That just helps the company out as well. I think it's a way to try and give back a little bit. Yeah. Not a massive, not a massive amount, but it's the least you can do. So it's good to it like there uh, when you look at Track Hat as well, because you think it's such a small company. Yeah. Uh, you know, and it is very, very difficult, isn't it? You know, to get your product out there with the willing to go and stand there for a day. Oh, I know, I know, and, absolutely. And, and had all the stuff set up for everyone, and uh, and and answer everyone's questions, and uh, everyone who was exhibiting there was very, very good. The lad, you were chatting to from Chill Blast. Yeah, he was lovely, absolutely. Every, I mean, know, so. everyone was just very, very nice, and did didn't seem yeah. a hassle for them being there. I just uh, was oh, big, big crash behind us. Big crash behind you're going to come along. I think huge crash. Someone tipped over. Try and see who it is. Uh, it might just be a, a driver's accident, but it was more just so he didn't hit them. Oh, it's one of Dave's lads, Ninja. Mm. Who's tipped? Yeah, he's on his side. You don't know who he's hit though. Like someone could I hit know. him, you know. I know, I know. I, I... He's had the red test. Hey, Ninja, whether you've got your ears on, I mean, if there's anything we can meet you. I know it was probably not nothing to do with yourself so let us know a lot of people go left here but I've got to go straight on right well I, I, I'm uh, now I've got to go and drop my job off yeah so is this Christian Sand here I'll just have to have a quick look I've got 127 miles to go I'm trying because I, I want to go with you lot yeah well I'm, I'm going left here right well I, you come you come to me and I'll follow you then because yeah my yeah, job, getting, my job's yeah. after yours. I know, so it, it is that kind of time when you need to. Dave's gonna need to turn around, I think. Right, so I, I, anyone following me and Mark to go and drop my job off first, and then we're gonna continue up to Oslo to uh, do the same for Marky. Uh, it was Callum that knocked someone over. Ah, uh, that's a shame. I know. He's a constant problem, unfortunately. Ah, oh, right. Oh, it seems to be, anyway. It's a shame to have to mention... Uh... Yeah, Matt, uh, you're right, Adam. That's, uh... He's going to follow me into Christian Sand, and then we're going to... Follow uh, Mark up the way. Cal just if Callum's got his ears on, I don't care if it was you or not. Using that language on Sugar's MP, at the end of the day, it's just unreal. You just, you just don't do it. If if Kevin's uh, on watching the chat, you will get a ban for that. Yeah, you don't use language like that on Sugar's MP. Don't get me wrong, if you want to phone me and talk to me like that to me first, that's fine. But you do not use language like that on Sugar's MP. There's no need yeah. to be using the C word two or three times and the F word yeah. and, and well, it's just, there's just no need. There you go, Kieran was listening. So it's a shame when you hadn't actually done anything to then, um, unfortunately, drop yourself in the grinder. Right, uh, uh, right. Hey, mate. I only said it. I only said it was you because I've seen you crash into a few folk a few times. That was all. You've crashed into me a couple of times. You literally pulled out the ferry on the wrong side of the road and crashed into somebody. I uh, just, I say, I wasn't blaming you. I didn't say it was you. You know, you should be banned, kicked, and stamped on. Uh, all I said was, okay, it might be Callum because your name keeps coming up all the time. Uh, and I had, I did actually apologise for mentioning your name. You did, and if it's that much of a problem, we're well, clearly all idiots. Just leave, and don't bother with us all. 
if it's making you that angry. Right, so where are you? Because I, 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 try, I try to chase you down, but I just kind of seem to find you. Um, just coming to the. Job. I've got a, I've got a ferry to catch. So. Ah right, so I'm I'm right, start, I, I'm in the middle come, of the town to, somewhere. Right, come to the red spanner. I'll wait right. here. There's a red spanner right next to the. Uh, I'll just uh, get my uh, map up and have a look. It must be taking me across just to do Where me... Where the hell's the red spanner at? Uh, That's straight on, is it? Yeah, straight on you. I know, it's just my sat now telling me to go everywhere else, so I can't actually see on my map. Yeah, you know the road I turned up, the E39? Yeah. You follow that road, there's only one way it goes. Yeah. I know, I, I'm there now. Oh, sorry, you're, just, you're there now. I was now. just talking to myself, I just, I couldn't... You said oh, on my map and you can't pause it, so I just, I couldn't see, I'm just talking to myself, sorry. Right, I, I've got to go across there to drop my job and then come back, so... Right, I'll park up in the red spot. I was going to say, uh, let everyone get a little bit of fresh air and I'll go and drop my job. Right, so... Yeah, it, it's weird when it says 90, 90 miles to go, but it obviously most of that's the actual uh, ferry. I know. <laughs> I'll be as quick as I can go on there and back. Alright. Uh, Joey, we're actually at uh, Christian Sand, really. Because we're all going to follow you, I reckon. Uh, don't forget everyone, I'm going across the water, drop my job, and I'm coming back again. So I actually thought you had to go to Christian Sun, so uh, you must have to go... Me? Yeah. Well, I thought that. I, I don't know where said, it's it. Oh, it's you... wanting me to go to the other ferry. It's Trifanga, or... There's another, you know when you zoom out on your map? Yeah, where we are one. right now, there's another ferry around the corner, that's where it's wanting me to go. Ah, right, so... So should I just come over to where you are? Um, I think you can... I think we can go up the coast, right? I, Hang I'm on. I'm not 100%, I'm... It, I, I'm just... Me, me job's here, so... Um, I'm, I'm literally... can come straight back across, so... Yeah, uh, Adam's saying come across. I can't, my, my game's frozen. Ah. Uh, ah, there we go. So yeah. yeah, so I've got to come across, right, okay. Yeah, I, I, Adam's saying just come across, yeah, and I'll... Uh... Yeah, got you, Adam. That's why all I was asking, mate, sorry. Yeah, and then the coastal road, which will be a nice road, yeah. Thanks for that, buddy. Uh, Sylvester. <coughs> uh, I don't. I, I don't know how many countries are watching though. No. Always makes me wonder because as my, you know, I've just bowls me over where people say where they're from. I, I love it. And then obviously there's people who watch the stream afterwards. Uh, oh you know, yeah. Um, yeah, I mean, for actual people-wise, we get very few watching now. Actually, like at the end of a stream, and yeah. then the next day, you know, you're looking at another ten thousand views or so. So yeah, it's, it's, it's a lot it's more amazing. people actually watch it after the stream. We 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 love always love having the, love having people to talk to. So so did you go over to Christian Sandon? Yes. Yeah. God, there's a little, there's a little hill climb, just to get to where the delivery is, and it's. So should I wait at the ferry port then? Because I yes. don't, obviously I don't know where you are. Yeah, no, you just wait there, mate. Are you gonna come back down then? Gotta come back down. There's only one way back. Right, okay. Well, let's go and park up our way then. Yep. Get your little flying camera out. Yeah. 
Right, that's. I've got to remember actually as well. I don't know whether you've done it yet. Where I'm trying, I've dropped my whole uh, trailer before. Oh, all the time. And I'm thinking, well, I actually need my trailer. Hey, firefighter, how are you doing, pal? Hello, buddy. Yeah, fire. You know it, buddy. You know it. <laughs> it's usually me. I'm. Uh, I, I am organised chaos. No, it was just with the two ferry ways. I just again, I was going to look at my map, but then I thought if you just got to come back anyway. Absolutely. But obviously, you don't. You don't need to come back. Uh, I don't think Delhi's been in tonight. Or she? Not? Yeah, I think she has. Huh? Oh, she's been in. Uh, I, I thought I'd seen her. Well, I'll apologise to her if uh, she's been in. Right, E button and unload trailer. That's good, buddy. Uh, right, we, Charles is telling me stream at 4pm in the US. And he's watching while, while he works. Oh, that's good, buddy. I love it. I love it how it gives it a, a, a chance to put another job on, you know, just for. I know. It's good, isn't know, it? I, I don't like that, yeah. Right, firefighter is good. Excellent, mate. Lauren's collection is late again. Well, Lauren, the, the funny thing is, I, I know what you're saying about the notifications, however seven days a week there's someone streaming on this channel nine to the eleven <laughs> yeah. so it's always nine even if we're five past nine five two nine nine to the eleven if you tune in there'll be someone on seven days a week yeah uh, it's going to change slightly when mark's away uh, mark's uh, getting his move but uh we'll do what we can yeah uh, yeah don't worry about that yeah so i'll i'll officially shut the you know, I'll, I'll do a video to say there won't be any content for a month. Ah, right. Oh, well, uh, there you go. The channel will be shut but over Christmas. Right. Too much for yourself to cope with. We've come back down to where the red spanner is. Uh, yeah. Is that where you are? No. Uh, well, I'm in the yeah. ferry. You told us to park up, so. Well, because I, I didn't have a chance to have a look at. Right, I'm just. Uh... So right. So do you want me to drive to the red spanner? Then? No. If you come out uh, onto the E18. Yeah, we need to go up. And we go up. We'll meet you. There's a roundabout just if you, as you come off the ferry terminal. Yeah. Okay, that'll do. Meet you on that. Cool. Someone just get rid of. Uh... Ford Mustang, please. I was—I didn't want to see out because I just assumed one of the mods will get rid of him, but he's clearly just being a penis. Yep. Excellent. Cheers, Dean. Oh, 20, 23, 21 in Denmark. Yeah, you're—you're you're on us. Uh, it's so strange how even when our clocks go backwards, yours go backwards as well. So you still always the hour. It's flux on that the same in Belgium, aren't they? You know, always yeah. that. Oh, nice firefighter, that's it. We get the door open and shut them out. Uh, right, Dean, the clocks always go back the last full weekend in October. Uh, Right, I'm going to pull over here because it's a, it's an actual tunnel. Yeah. So yeah, the last full weekend. So have a look at whichever that is. Uh, I don't know exactly when that'll be. Uh, no, it's not uh, Scandinavian. Yeah, uh, northeast of England, both of us. Sometimes I've looked at him and obviously I wonder uh, where he did originate from, but <laughs> I've, uh, his mum reliably informs me that uh, he was he was made in... I, I've never really been able to nail it down where the manufacture took place. I don't want to know. Or the creation. Is that what you call it? Creation? Because you are more of a creation, aren't you? I am. Not, right. a, not a crustacean, a creation. Uh, 
Hi Connor Harris, watching from Manchester, I like that. Right, get, get going mate. <laughs> they were coming from the care home, yeah I like that. I'll follow what you. The, what the care home have me? I wanna follow you. 27th of October, thank you firefighter. There you go everyone, put that in your diary. Right, 50 will be the limit. Yeah. Bear in mind, I don't know where I'm going. Yeah, just keep going, I'll tell you when you need to turn off, once I catch you. Drive C to D road for once, no. We've done it once, that was enough. I mean, if I ever have to drive and I was just driving it, it's not like a... Oh, why everyone makes that out to be such a thing. Me and Udge were on it the uh, day before yesterday. Morning, Oz Farmer, how's it going? Well, the, the day we, the night we came up it, there was like, someone told me that's the road that they were all talking about, and we had, I don't think we had an issue at all, literally. Yeah. I've just seen a Renault. Captured duck, there's a Renault. Broken down. Renault warning, Renault warning. Eyes left. Actually wasn't, the guy's just picked the truck up and he's actually outside sitting on the floor crying that he has to drive it. <laughs> he's just bought it. <laughs> no, his manager's just said, That's what I mean. Hey, guess what? We've got a new truck for you today. But. <laughs> it's a Renault. They must have made something that was good. I mean, even the new ones that are, you start to see on the roads a lot now, they just look bad. You know, they don't look that good, either. No, they've got no. a very, very odd front end on them. They're very plasticky as well, a bit like the inside of, a, of an actual Renault car, you know. The 2CV is going to be one of them iconic, um, you know, not, not a good, not a good. well, obviously it's been a good car, because they, they, they still kick it off, but... It's probably one of the first really economical things that, that we had. Yeah. And, st and still making them. Build here all night. Ah, get ready for a nap, mate. Yep. Yeah. Got you there, buddy. See, see they, made, uh, they made the Renault 2CV, and all we could come up with is the Robin Reliant with three wheels on. The Renault 2CV? Was it a Renault? A Citroen, what? sorry. What even, yeah, sorry. Where even uh, are you? I'm, I'm, oh, just ignore me, I'm <laughs> just sticking the loud. <laughs> Renault Jesus. and Citroen, I'm, I've, I've just he heaped them in the same pile. I mean, they are both French, you know. That's what I was, I think that's where I was going. Band there. word, I, but yeah. Yeah, I think that's where I was going with it, like. Uh, G, G, G Pro, G. G G G Pro. That's, that's an <laughs> that annoying that name. Is so hard anyway, to get that. Pro. <laughs> uh, forty inch. Buddy, yeah, forty inch. My dad's on forty twos. Renault five turbo, yeah, but that was a good car though. Apart from obviously they fall, fell apart, but still, uh, yeah, still a nice car. Even the Renault five is not a bad car, like the five turbo. I tell you what, I did like is the uh, the Renault when they were rallying it, the Renault. Oh, Megan, can't remember. seven speed. Oh, the Mag ah, that was nice as well. <laughs> Is that not the one you're on about? No, the Peugeot, not the 3 or 6 Maxi. Yeah, not, aye, that as well, but there was, they did a smaller one then as well. It was in the 2000 uh, Rally Championship. Uh, 106. 106, yeah, that's yeah. it, 106. Yeah, thank you. That was 106 Maxi as well, and I thought, yeah, I quite like that as well. But yeah, that, 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 that was nice. But you see, because it's a rally car, they've took everything that is wrong out. What speed are you doing? I mean, I'm doing 70 and I kind of catch you. I'm doing 50. I, can't, I just I can't catch you. I'll slow down. I'm trying. I think it's up the hills with the load on. I, ju I just kind of oh, keep up with you. Definitely. I, I, I definitely... Ah, I'm coming to the next checkpoint, so I'm going to go behind you. Okay. <clears throat> uh, thanks, uh, thanks, Jesus. Oh, there's Mark. Wait, the speed you're doing there? Flying. I know, I've been trying to catch you. What kind of speed were you doing there? 75, like yeah. Are you on race mile? 
Yeah, I had to. I was trying to catch you because you were getting away and you don't know where you're going. Yeah, but I, 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 the last at least six or seven years, I don't really know where I've been going. No. To be fair. Oh, I've but, no idea where I came from. My day has been really good, mate. Thanks for asking. Yeah, getting getting excited now for the for the move and that. Like it's yeah, I'm really looking forward to it. We're back down there again tomorrow. Oh, so. firefighter, nice one. The Renault Clio, the Williams edition. Gotta say it. Yeah, it was a little uh, pocket rocket, that thing. Definitely. Yeah. Uh, I don't know, mate. I don't know what part I'm going to, to be honest with you. I'll probably go to the Red Spanner, I would think, once you get up there. It's it's sp so split up, Oslo. Yeah. <clears throat> we'll, uh, we'll see when you get there. How many um, mileages have you got? 126. Oh, cool. I've slowed, I've slowed down, like. Yeah, I'm doing 50. I can see you. Yeah, little legs, 126, buddy. Uh, Norway Live is like, oh, I can imagine you on us uh, getting into your sort of winter time. I don't know when you get the snow there. There's a lot, there's a lot of parts of the world which you know, you'd like to go and visit, I think. Yeah. Ah, there's Grant telling everyone about the stability on the trailer. The bottom I've, left, like... I've left mine alone, even though I did tip my truck over, but that was my own ah, fault. I've tipped mine over a bit as well, but I, I haven't changed it because it's my fault. Right, thanks, Adam. Uh, yeah, I'll just follow Mark and we'll... we'll We'll get the job done first and see where we end up. Hiya, fat boys. Uh, uh, evening, Grant. How are you today? I've got that tattoo finished yet. Tattoo uh, is not a big tattoo he's getting. If it's the big one he's getting, it'll be a while that before that's finished. You don't just finish stuff like that. Ah, tomorrow. Ah, all uh, farmers in. Ah, cheers, bud. Much appreciated for the donation. Oh wow. Uh, Jordan, uh, both my father and grandfather both had classic Mini Coop as well, which I got chased by the police. <laughs> yeah, that's another classic. I mean, it's a classic car, but it was a classic rust bucket. Yeah. Like all the classics. Yep. <laughs> uh, yeah, Dean, one, one thing I, um, uh, being, being, being out where it was busy and on the roads brought back some quite, uh, Palpitations again. I I don't like being where the traffic is now. I'm uh... Uh, the the Resco wheels and shifters. So I've got two wheels and two shifters. Right, and I play VR. I think about changing to a setup like you. Yeah, we're up, we're up. actually wondering we would keep the VR and use it alongside everything we've got. Yeah, most people need to sell to yeah to change pay for the stuff. Yeah. But it's one of them things, if you're going to change VR to like 324 inch screens, that's not the same experience as what we have. No. Uh, don't get me wrong, I like my 324s and if you mount them correctly, you can still have a good experience. However, the reason the GoPro looks so good on my head is because this is such a big, good experience, but it does take up a lot of room. Uh, price wise, it's not bad. It's the same as getting three decent monitors, to be fair. A cheap, a, a cheap 27 inch monitor will set you back about 150 you know a reasonable one with nice bezels and that you can pay up to two, 200 plus so my screens were less than that that's uh, Zacune in a Renault believe it or not ah. and that was going that was quite fast that that, but, the, that the one that was parked up crying 
Yeah, what, what he hasn't said, it's actually uh, not in gear and the engine isn't on, it's a very strong tailwind. Yeah, it's actually downhill. Yeah, so we're, we've actually got our engine brakes on, holding ourselves back. Yeah, I mean, Dean, to be fair, like, I hate Renaults as much as the next person, but there is certain cars that are good, I, I agree, like, same yeah. as Fiat. You know, I wouldn't wee on a Fiat if it was burning. However, if it was a 131 R bath, I would absolutely. Absolutely. Because it's a hell of an iconic, beautiful car. VR is immersive, but lower quality. Three screens is better for me at least, yep. Purely just depends what you're after. Same yeah. as some people won't even look at a TV, won't use them, hate them, terrible. So, but for me, great experience. Right, uh, best pocket rocket uh, T Sport Yaris and Peugeot 106. Yeah, we're on about the 106s actually. Uh, oh, the 106s are. They're, they're quite an iconic car, like. Again, right. um, I did, I did, I did uh, Oz Farmer. I did put the uh, the bar up there to show where it where's it where it's going to as well. So, and I did say thank you for yep, the donation, buddy. Yeah. Much appreciated. As always, yeah. big help. Fiat Gaiman mentioning Toyota. Uh, what would be a classic Toyota off the top of your head? One I haven't seen in any of the car game uh, is the they did a, um, a Group B rally car, Toyota Celica. Uh, Group B. Yeah. I've, it's never been recreated, like the Nissan 240 RS. That's ne I've never seen that recreated. No, you so, all go right here. Um, I'm just following you, so. Well, they're all going right, and I'm going to go straight on. So, uh, so for me, like my dad, obviously his his iconic stuff's all rally wise. For me, like the the Celica GT4 was quite an iconic, uh, you know, quite an iconic car to myself. Uh, yeah. But Toyota wise, there's just so many of them, especially the old ones, and I am a massive fan of a chaser. Uh, you know that that sort of I don't know on the Toyota front, but that type of car on the drift scene is what I like. Yeah. Uh, there's so well, many different ones. A VR6. There's another fantastic car, Carrado 1600, uh, 1800 supercharged. Yeah, I've got the one in uh, Forza. Yeah. Uh, well, the VR6 isn't supercharged. The VR6 is like a two point something, I think. Two point six. Ah, right. The so VR6. Which one's in the which one? Ah, right, yeah, yeah. Which one's in the game then? The I Corrado? Think, yeah, the Corrado, I think it's a VR6 in the game, but uh, Philip had the something. It was a. I can't remember. Is it the something 60? Oh, uh, that's right. Because there's a 40 in the 60. The 40 came in the Polos, which was a 14 supercharged. G60. Yeah. The G60. G60. And that, that was the 1800. Yeah, it was that 1800 uh, supercharged. Yeah. But it wasn't the VR6. The VR6 was the big boy car. Yeah. So, all right, uh, twin turbo super. Yeah, again, that two JZ. Problem is with the with the supers is, I would definitely have one, but pretty much most of them that would be affordable to me would all be automatic, uh, and would you would need to do that manual conversion. Yeah. See the the Celica. Uh, I don't know if it was the GT. Or what they were rallying through the eighties, you know the yeah when the, the Ford Cosy was out. Oh, that that uh, was Ashback Salika, was it not? No, because no. that was the Corolla. That was oh, Corolla. Sorry, day. yeah, yeah, got you there. Yeah. So th they did the uh, four-wheel drive Toyotas, you know, the like Group A's at the yeah. time. But they were, I'm going to say, Salika, uh, but I don't know exactly. I don't want to say which ones. No, no, I will get you there. Because. Um, yeah, I just can't, I can't remember. My, my, my mind uh, doesn't. Uh, I'd have to look it up. Not as good as a, uh, an RS, obviously. No, no. Oh no, I would prefer Mark II. Yeah, or a factory at Mark One. William, stop listening. <sighs> Is Bad William me. not in today? Oh, Jesus Christ, I'm half asleep. Wait, where do I need to be? <laughs> 
I don't know, if I had done that, I would have got, you would have to get yelled at there. Yeah, sorry, I've, right, got no right. I, I've got no idea where I'm going. Oh, right, right there, that would have been, oh, I don't know what I, what words would I would have got for that. Oh, look at all the lads who've had to come down here, oh, that's, oh, I've just got 2% damage, my whole truck's broken now. Sorry. Sorry, right, I muted you, we can't hear you. Oh, oh <laughs> did you? No. Oh. Oh, why have I pulled in? Because you're an idiot. Ah, oh, tool. Yeah. That tool would have been the better word yet. Ah, uh, I've pulled in now. I've, had no, I've got stuck as well and I had no need to pull in. <laughs> you have no need to follow us this far in. I know, I know, but why did you stop? Why didn't you stop me? Because you're your own man, aren't you? No, you know I'm not. <laughs> you know, <laughs> you know fine well you and Mum tell me what I've got to do on a daily basis. <laughs> You want to get a job from here? Yes. Because it's got to be a quick end. Or we could yeah. just drive with uh, empty to a, to a place if you want. Oh, yeah, let's do some empty. Right. So, we are where we are now. Uh, yeah. And we'll just go sure. from here. Do you want me to have a look at the map to confuse us as well, or are you picking? I'll pick. So, I would say how far's. We're not going to get to Aubrey, are we? Or. What's that Uppsala, called? Uppsala. Is that Uppsala, is it? Up in the right top, right top right corner. No, not there. We're not going to get there in 20 minutes. Are we not? Are we? 500, 400 yeah. miles? Well, you're right. So what about Bergen? On the, on the cut. Ah, right, good cut. What about uh, Olympia no. Pig? Uh, oh, yeah. Uh, yeah, we've got, we've got a Pig. Right, where's that? Right in the middle. Is Red. that near Gort Gortberg? Red Spanner. Have you, have you got it? I haven't. It's right, I mean, it's right. So, oh, on that, the right hand side. Right, right where Linkerpin is. Yeah, right, I'm going there. Yeah. Linkerping. Yeah, did, uh, where's Oz Farmer at? Crack it, Neil. Yeah, because I, I think he must have missed his talking, so I hope he's. I definitely did though mate, so t t thank you. Yeah, definitely. I hate, I, I, I hate it if I ever do miss anything, but... No, I, I definitely... Uh, yes, uh, firefighter, I did get a, uh, a ride in a Lotus Carlton. Oh, na nice car that, man. Uh, now, I've got one in... I'm going to say Forza 3, but it might be Forza 7. Uh, Motorsport 7. Yeah, there is one in uh, Horizon 4 as well. Oh, is there? Oh, hi. Speeding all the horizons. We're all at the red spanner. Ah, so should we go past the red spanner then? We should. Right, well hang on, I'll need to change my sat nav. Because it's at the other end. Uh, you won't be able to just drive there. Right, I'll... Uh, it's uh, there. So, yeah, are you going round the top half? Well, we'll, we'll have to. Yeah, mine took me around. Mine, mine took me around the bottom bit. No, mine, mine's getting me. Do you want to follow me? I'm just next to you anyway. Yeah. Yeah, Lotus Carton, a good one. Yeah, I, lo I love a night where we shout out something old, <laughs> something we can remember. Right, once we get on the road, we'll do a 60 mile an hour limit, and it gives everyone a, an extra bit of mileage to catch up if they need to. I mean, a lot of people have a, a fascination with like your, you know, like your parents' first car, or like me. I, I always looked up to my uh, my brothers for a bigger influence. So I do remember my dad's Hillman Electro was probably the same steering wheel as what I'm using. It's like a bigger square steering wheel. I couldn't believe it was square. <laughs> Typical British build. Yeah. Austin Electro is the worst. Oh, Oz Farmer, yeah, I, I know what you mean, mate. I do appreciate it, though. It's going towards uh, the floor in, in the new games room, so... If you come back in a month or so, you'll at least see where it's gone. Fiat 11090, uh, Is that a car, uh, Fiat Gamer? I honestly I don't know. 11090's a tractor. Oh, tractor. I was yeah, just gonna say, I, I, for your gamer, isn't it? He always he sleeps, breathes, loves. I, did, I nearly said as, 
I didn't actually said but I was afraid to up upset is it a tractor so I wasn't sure. Has anyone out there tried the crew too? I I've seen people play it. Watched a mm. lot of streams on it. That's why I never bought it. I'm just wondering how many wish the bought for the point said. It's by bought, don't you? Quite oh dear, crew. Yeah. It's an arcade yeah. game, if you've got a controller, it's an arcade game, so... Oh, Aiden, you've nailed it, yeah, the E30. E30 M3 is a nice car. I mean, look at the BMs, actually. Oh, have you? Well, just, obviously, with them, I'm saying, you know, maybe it's next year or the year after, we could try and have a, uh, you know, a drift oh, a drift car to go drifting with, if I put a, you know... Uh, I, I'm actually thinking about it. Wouldn't be that hard to put a pedal box in in, in both sides. No. Uh, so yeah. Anyway, so I was looking at stuff and that, and seeing loads of like uh, the like the three one eight and that you know the estates, the tours. Yeah. Like four yeah. or five hundred quid. You know. Really. Oh, aye. Like perfect. Two two liters and two point fives. You know. Wow. That's ideal. I know, I mean, okay, I wouldn't need the state car, but stripped out with a cage welder, then it'd be awesome. Uh, I know. Mark 2 has got, yeah, obviously it is. Well, see, my my, uh, my elder brothers uh, were, were escorts, you know, either Mark 1, or uh, we started off in Cortinas, I think. But. Yeah. Uh, Oz Farmer, yeah, I mean, I, I could do your, uh, I could do your advertisement for your farm. <laughs> you could put me down as that. Yeah. Get him as a part supply. <laughs> <laughs> but there's, there's one thing for sure. When you when you cross there, and if you do have your own car and somewhere to work on it, you uh, you're not going to be stuck for someone to go with you. Oh no, 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 no! I mean, Emma said she 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 wouldn't mind towing it. So, but physically, yeah. like, there's no way I'd go up with drift event and Hutchie wouldn't be there. There's absolutely no way. No, exactly. So, so no, it's something the the moment all I'm concerned about is just getting a new room up up and running before Christmas. So, but stuff like that in the future is great to you know have your have your eyes set to somewhere. Yeah, it will be awesome to be like you know stick your fingers up to something like that and, and actually enjoy you know being able to drive see you later firefighter thanks as always buddy i'll be on tomorrow night firefighter yeah see you later pal thanks again mate uh, Grandad's car was an escort thirsty she always thirsty escort right yeah i'm, I'm surprised with that Oh yeah, Master Astra, Astra, Astra GT. Yeah, my uh, that's another car I haven't seen uh, represented in the Forza. Now I don't know about the earlier Forza. Uh, uh, Astra GT. Nah, you know, uh, no, this is not one that's popular. Don't get me wrong, it would be popular if you put it in, but uh, no. I mean, there's there's the other one, the uh, the Cavalier, you know, or the Nova. Yeah, I mean, oh, Nova, the, the, yeah, of the, course. The, the GT Nova is an iconic car. He absolutely is. Yeah, GT, yeah. So, and he had the GSI. The GSI was nice. See, the Astra GSI. I know I'm going to go into the rally one, but it was the first one that I knew to take, put, use a six-speed box. Yeah. Uh, once they changed to you know rallying the front-wheel drive stuff. But yeah, Finley, how are you doing, buddy? Uh, I'm using Sharp TVs. From Asda, they were 190 pounds each. Right, I'm. Um, uh, we'll just be going straight out, won't we? Yeah. So. Just be careful when you come round that right-hand corner. They've all parked in a bit of a silly way. What's been a good uh, yes, Nova for the win, yeah, Dean. That's. With a red top, you, you can imagine going in the uh, in the game and, and you go to the uh, the spanner and you you just select red top. <laughs> yeah, I mean the the Calibra, like for me, was an awful looking car, but because they came with the two liter turbos in as well, 
that was yeah. such an iconic car for people having in the back garden ripping the engine yeah. out and sticking it in the course of B's or, or the Novas it was just what people did for me the 2 litre turbo was just too far the a red top on carbs was just oh just so well, quick I, I mean that the the Cavalier GSI you yeah, know, and, yeah. and he, he, he did say that was, that was quick oh yeah it's just a phenomenal engine like and yeah. still, I mean they're still getting ripped out today to be used I mean the courses and Novas aren't as common now but there's still people doing it well like you say even if the cars have rotted away yeah now I don't know where I'm going so I'm going to have to follow somebody uh, I've just gone you go, you go right up the bridge I thought you were behind us I'm just going to have to put in uh me, me coordinates. I'm just parked up on the top of the bridge in case you want to see me. Yeah, I'm looking for Linkoping. Or Linkoping. I found it the first time I looked for it. Lost it now. Come I assumed on. you just had, I assumed you put it in your sat nav straight away. Well, I, I, when I went round the top end of the uh, the thing, I just reset my sat nav. So yeah, ah. I'm, I'm I'm on it now. No worries. See you later, Adam. See you tomorrow. I hope. So can I get up to sixty then? You can go sixty if you want to do sixty, mate. Well, just we've got eleven minutes to do two hundred and fifty mile. Right, uh, probably not going to get it done. Well, it's not a delivery, is it? So, no, but I'm just saying, like, there's no point in sitting nice 50, to... is there? No, no, I'll get it done. Can't tip over either because we're flatbed. Oh, the flatbeds tip over easier than the. Oh, do they? Oh, that's the bit I don't like about the new weird thing. Is there's no oh. difference between an actual trailer and a flatbed. And I had two concrete slabs on, on a flatbed and tipped over and I'm like, hang on, it's two concrete flatbeds compared to like a curtain side, surely the curtain side would tip over easier, because it's the top end weight. Yeah. Uh, Zeke asking about, uh, what do we think about electric, I mean my own personal, anything that's running on electric now, and it's uh, battery. Uh, batteries are still going to get better and better. Anyone who bought a battery power car maybe five, six years ago, probably, I don't know how, how it compares to what's about now. Yeah. But they're always, the range is going to get bigger and bigger all the time. So I don't know when the right time is to get one. I don't know. There's Unless a, you live in a town. Exactly. I mean, there's one thing for sure. If no one buys them and all, everyone sticks by that thing of, I'll just wait, then they, they wouldn't even be progressing. They exactly. would be worse than how they were. So yeah the more people are buying now the, the more they can use the money to better themselves and the better they'll be in a few years I mean the government did a massive giveaway I, I don't even know how it worked out for people to try and encourage people to buy them because but look what look what it was like with diesels and all that and then eventually oh there you're in the garage yeah I had to stop for fuel so I'll catch you don't stop so yeah I actually I don't know what the answer is. I'm just thinking out aloud. D diesel owners are getting hammered now. So oh, yeah. that that that's obviously been and gone and the time to have bought a diesel and used a diesel is you know. Well so. with, with the smaller petals coming out now with exactly. the turbos on and, and they're, they're they're getting uh, you know fairly fuel efficient as well, so diesels but, aren't as needed now. I mean, Richard, Richard took us down in a 1.4 Seat he had. Yeah. Uh, and that was uh, that was so quiet. Oh, it was. Diesels are noisy, like even the new ones, like. That's right. Uh, no, I don't vape, but my uh, I nearly said my mum vapes. Mark's mum vapes. Oh, I didn't know it was coming in the single. Sorry. All right. I thought it was a dual carriage way. <laughs> so did he. <laughs> Whoever that was, my bad. <laughs> I just looked in my mirror and I thought, who on earth is that going to try well, and I get just, down I, there? I saw the three lanes and I thought, oh, okay, I didn't realise there was a barrier in between them. Oh, you can ban me, mate. Go for it. 
Yeah. I'm all sorted. I've got three accounts, so I'm good. Three games, three accounts. That's what I do when I when they when they get me banned the trolls. I just log into with my other account. <laughs> I don't, uh, I don't, mate. So but again, I, because because I can't ever stop streaming, I've already sorted it. I see some streamers crying because the trolls recorded them and got them banned. It's like, just go and buy the game again. And, you know, if, if you need to stream, it, yeah. it's, it's very fixable. That's why I have the game three times. Uh, Dean, it's a uh, diesel. I think they were 2.4, I think. So I get, I get hammered on car tax and yours yeah 2.2 2.2 2. 2, there you go yeah so yeah get hammered a bit on the uh what is your so car tax 200 and uh, same as our yeah if yeah. i said 240 I'd, it'd be shy of 240 so, so i had 236 in my mind but i'd, I'd have to check so s same as our volvo yeah and our big car the score so, was what 126 six months you what sorry, Miss Gordon was 126 at six months when we got rid of it. Right. I'm pretty sure it was. The score uh when I first, I remember first, when I first got it, it was hundred and ten pound a year. Yeah. And by the time we'd sold it it was uh just under hundred and fifty pound a year. A year, right, okay. I thought it was more because I thought it was uh more than our focus was. No, it was if I said 145 a year, that seems to stick in my mind. Ah, so okay. that's over the length of time we had it, which is a long time, so ah. it wasn't too bad. But just shows you, why, why would it have gone up? I know, yeah, I know. So, yeah, the new Octavia's are nice. I, I never actually got around to getting an Octavia. I did, I did want one, but... Uh, Unfortunately, I would have carried on having our steer cars for work, but uh, we just needed a van, and unfortunately, it, well, it worked out well for us anyway as a family, but yeah. well, me and Mark actually <laughs> for our hobbies. So. See you later, Lewis. Oh, another tool. Why, why don't he just leave you alone? I know, just get the band man, ban him. No, I mean, playing it. Jokes aside, playing about and having a bit of fun is completely and utterly allowed on MP, uh, in my opinion. But as long as the roads are clear, you can see on your map if there's any dots around you. You just need to use your brain a little bit. Yeah, there's no way to actually run into someone, is there? Like, I mean, it's been a long time. To, like, actually, I'm on about like overtaking someone in a dangerous place that I've actually run into someone. Seriously. Yeah, and, I, and I've it's a long time since I've done 80 miles an hour. Ever. Well, I know that's what I'm saying. We never do it. No, I was just uh, saying everyone. I'm forgetting about Forza. <laughs> it, 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 if you keep your foot in, we'd actually make it. There's only 100 mile left. My foot's in, buddy. What are you doing? 92. Uh, 80, 90, 90. Right. 80, 89 at the moment. Trying. Yeah. I'm 91. Right. Yeah, I'm just trying to think as well. My dad's car, he got a, I think it's a one litre with a, a turbo on it. Yeah. I think that's what they're doing, obviously, getting the small petals, putting a turbo on and realising it can get more performance. <laughs> Andy, yeah, uh, you're right there, mate, yeah. We both need the loo. Foot down. On a promise. Yeah, blast us out them bad boys, yeah. Clean, clean the spark plugs. Oh, Neil. Oh. <laughs> that was some that was some steaming input. Just cuz I like you and I'm going to help you out. There is a tight right hand corner coming up. Right. Okay. Love the new point 2.3 turbo. Ah, see what you're saying, buddy. I, I should have asked uh, William what uh, what size engine was in the, in the new XC90. I don't know. It'll be two, two or two point five. Oh no, right. it could be two or a three actually. It's two point oh, five. Really? Well, they're not that common now. 
If it's a diesel, the three litre diesels are becoming very common. Yeah, you're right, Andy, yeah, desperate. You're right there, mate. Yeah. Well, we, just, we, we said we would do an empty run with the trucks, and we don't normally do it often, but because we only had 20 minutes to, to drop, and I just, I'm, I'm intrigued to see if I can get there. It's 58 now. I'm intrigued if I can get there for 11. I'll get I mean, as far I as I can. I can't even remember the last time uh, we actually did uh, together at, uh, excessive speed on here. Well, do you want to actually? Do you want to pull over at this garage, or do you want to actually just get in there? Because we've only got 55 mile left. Yeah, get it, get it done. Yeah. There's a truck coming on the left, guys. Just to warn you. Uh, yeah, Dean, uh, XC90 or 60, right? Uh, I'm sure there's a difference in the size. Yeah, there is, yeah, absolutely. So, I'm sure there'll be two different purposes, but though. Is the XC90 a little bit more off the ground? I can't. No. I, with, the, with the Volvos, I, 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 I have, have no idea. With, with the Volvos, I don't know. Uh, right, we've got, I've got 48 miles, Mark's going to have about 46-ish. Yeah. I'm, uh, Yeah, I've got 38. Right, I'm... I'm kidding it. You are kidding it. Ah, right, the XC90s are only 2 litre, excellent. Well, it'll probably be a turbo on there, I would imagine. Or, or a few. <laughs> or a few, yeah. <laughs> so. Well, the Skodas did the they did the twelve hundred uh, turbo supercharged on the newer versions. Yeah, the, that, that was on the one point four, but it was a one point two. I thought it was a one point two, but that again could be wrong. Well, I, I in you know, I, I honestly thought being wrong. I thought the twin charge ones were the lower engine size. That's very why popular, they were twin very charged. Very positively, yeah. Yeah. Wait, Cheryl's been. Cheryl's got that, that one point two Fiesta, and she's over the moon with it. Oh, they go well. I mean, Emma's. Uh, Emma's 1.2 Fiesta was the same, it was a 1.275, it went oh, really was well. It? Yeah. Yeah, because then we moved on to 1400 Focus. It was 1.9, sorry. Yeah, but no, no, go on. 1.9 TDIs, I've got to say, I, I found them very good. Well, it depends which, which one but it was, <laughs> in I'm my gonna, opinion. I'm going to take the words out of my mouth, I'm going to say I had the... Um, PD. PD one, so... The, the 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 19 PDs uh, an iconic the 115 yeah 130 and 170 or whatever they were an absolute iconic engine uh, yeah. yeah PD 130s or the PD 115 or you know any of the PDs such yeah. an iconic engine uh, and again if you if you added the the 150 I think it was one with the DSG box at the time which is another iconic paddle shift and gearbox they ruined, yeah. they ruined it after that, and uh, and it, that, you know the actual like both of them. It's, that's it was a hell of a combination. But the like our Volvo is technically a a 1.9 TDI and it's terrible. It's got no go in it at all. Really? Oh, I. I thought I I, I thought it was okay, but oh, I, I mean didn't it's realize. like a tractor. Like I mean it'll you know it'll pull itself. You know, even with the wheels hanging off, don't get me wrong, but it's not a. Yeah. It's, uh, yeah, it's not, certainly not a. You know, <laughs> yeah. It's not sprightly. No, definitely not. This is what we were like pulling into McDonald's, weren't we? With yeah. Richard. Absolutely. Just park it there and. I've even pressed to get rest. What did I do? Was that for? I don't need <laughs> <this>. <laughs> Cause you, you. Two. Uh, yeah. That, uh, well, that's a, that's a no contest. That. <laughs> right. So, just a little bit of context. Uh, I will not be on tomorrow, and I will not be on Wednesday. My dad will be on probably both days at nine. Uh, yeah. If there's any other content, great. But both days at nine, definitely. And uh, again, if you get a notification saying he's on in the afternoon, that's a bonus. Yeah. Uh, I will be back obviously on Thursday. Thursday night is GTA night. 
uh, so with my dad so there won't be any convoys or anything until Friday with me stabbing yeah do some stabbing so thanks again for joining if you enjoy the content give it a like if anyone knows a good cheap place for grey laminate don't forget to send that to my Facebook messenger it would be a great help uh, and I'll see you all on Thursday yeah take care everyone see you tomorrow bye